Do you have a green thumb? Regardless of your self-appraisal, you'll find something of interest in this lesson about a plant known as Vasilok in Russian. More in a few moments, but first check out the vocabulary words for this lesson while the intro song plays. Ruski Ed is his game, and speaking Russian is his game. If it is Russian, you would like to know, the Ruski Ed is the place to go. Called Vasilok in Russian and Centaria in English, there are several common names for this group of plants, including knapweed, star thistle, bluettes, cornflower, and loggerheads. Also in this genus are bachelor buttons, takalote, and dusty miller. Many members of this genus are considered to be invasive weeds. But on the other hand, many members of this genus are cultivated in gardens or are considered to be highly attractive wildflowers. Eta sarnyak ili jalatelnaya rastenia dla sada means, is it a weed or is it a desirable plant for the garden? U vasilka privlaka telnaya sveti means, knapweed has attractive flowers. Also, blue eyes are often referred to as vasilkovaya glaza, for your information. Similarly, cornflower honey is known as vasilkovi myot. By the way, you might like this painting by Isaac Leviton. It's called Cornflowers. And that gets us to the list of Vasilok species listed in the Red Book, or Krasnaya Kiniga in Russian. Angelaski, Bogatsky, Barbeya, Karpatsky, Lajnabe Loche Shuichati, Talievo, and Turkey. We should talk a little about a plant known as Russian knapweed. First of all, it should be pointed out that Russian knapweed is not a member of the Vasilok genus, although it is a member of the sunflower family. It is only remotely related to the knapweeds in the Vasilok genus. That being said, here are some interesting facts about Russian knapweed. Eta rastania yadavita dla skata means this plant is toxic to livestock. It is a perennial noxious weed or monogaletni zlosni sarnyak, with zlosni meaning noxious, malicious, or pernicious. The scientific name for Russian knapweed is Rapanticum repens or Garchak palzuchi or Garchak rosavi. In Russian, with polzuchi meaning creeping or crawling and rosavi meaning pink. Also, it is said that some people have a green thumb, which of course means that they are skilled gardeners who are successful at growing plants. The literal translation in Russian is not understood to have this meaning. Instead, we might say, On znayet tok sadovosti shtobwe on ne pasadil vesyo rastyo, which means he knows a lot about gardening. No matter what he plants, everything grows. Or... Umeli Sadavodam, which means skilled gardener, or Talat Kavui Rashevaniu Svitov, which means talent for growing flowers. And finally, it should be noted that Yist Raznitsa Mejdu Svitkom i Mukoi, which means there is a difference between flower and flower. It has been a pleasure delivering this lesson. Hope you enjoyed it. Ruskiad, signing off now. Das Vidanya!